Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Yes! Chess moves, everybody loves it, but not many plays it. But do you guys know which are the five most brilliant moves ever played in the history of chess? Well, this video is all about that. So no more boring intros, we will quickly jump to our number 5. This shockingly incredible move was played by Grandmaster Ifen Geller in 1949 USSR Championship. It's black to move and Geller rook is under attack but instead of saving it he plays the astonishing brilliant king to g7. What? Galler is blundering a rook? Not really because if you take the rook there is no way to save the promotion of the A pawn. This move is actually very deep because if you save the rook on 4th rank f takes e5 will come with a check and you will depart with your rook. And if you play rook to e1 again f takes e5 and it will be a draw in the end. If you think this was brilliant then let's jump to number 4. This one is the forest of a brilliant moves. This inhuman sequence of a moves were played by John Says Aguaru in 1933 Madrid City. And man what a brutal sequence it is. Here Sen sacrificed the rogue with brilliant rook takes b2. Okay, okay, he wants to promote his c pawn but how he's actually going to do it? Just watch the sequence, after knight takes rook he plays c3. Here white can't play knight to d3 here because of c4 check and even if you take the bishop here this connected two pawns are just enough for black to win the game. So what if white takes the bishop, uh, you guys can't handle this sequence. He is not going to take the rook, he will play c4. White can't take with the knight because c pawn will be unstoppable so here only move is to play rook to b4. But now a5 and if he takes the pawn with the rook, pawn takes knight and there is no way to save the promotion. Even if you take with the knight there is no way to save the promotion. If I don't mention number 3 it will be a crime to chess because this is one of the moves that made the chess popular. The gold coin move, many of you have seen it so let's relive it. If you're new to chess this legendary move was played by Frank Marshall vs Stephen Levitsky and after this move gold coins were thrown at the chess board. Can you guys guess this move? It is brilliant queen to g3. Now this queen can be captured with either h pawn, f pawn and even with the queen. But either way white takes it he is losing the game. If he takes with the h pawn it's checkmate with knight to e2. If he takes with the f pawn it's mate in 2 with knight to e2 check king to h1 and rook takes f1. And if you takes with the queen you will see knight to e2 check king to h1 knight takes queen and you can't take with the f pawn because rook takes rook will be checkmate. And black can even take the rook and it will be a winning position. The move that I ranked number 2 was played by magical, marvelous, magnificent Magnus Carlsen. This breathtaking move was played in 2016 in world championship match between Magnus Carlsen and Sergei Karyakin. This is the final rapid game so who wins the match wins the game so that's why this psychologically is in number 2. Looks like Magnus Carlsen is getting checkmated in many ways but why to worry when you can checkmate yourself. In this position Magnus plays the brilliant queen to h6. Now if you take with the king rook to h8 is a checkmate and if you take with the g pawn rook to f7 is a checkmate. Now finally the way it is over this move is the mother father of all queen sacrifices played in the history of chess. This legendary queen sacrifice was played by Rain Meyer vs Stephen Muller. And wow what a move it is. In this position Meyer plays the brilliant queen to c7. This queen can be taken by 3 pieces here and none of them work here. If you take with the c rook it's just mate in 2. If you take with the d rook bishop to d5 leads to a very brutal checkmate. And if you take with the queen it's again mate in 2. If you love this video do like the video and subscribe to the channel and also comment down your favorite move in this video. So have an excellent health and see you soon all.